You could bioengineer some type of algae, for example, to consume more carbon. And the idea basically being seed the ocean with nutrients, because that's usually the limiting factor yeah. with algae growth in the ocean, is that especially in deeper parts of the ocean, it's very nutrient poor because you don't get that up well from the ocean floor. So things like algae don't have the nutrients they need to grow. So that is one solution is, okay, we'll seed the ocean with the nutrients the algae needs. You'll get blooms of algae and that'll absorb a bunch of carbon dioxide. Hopefully a lot of the algae will actually, you know, sink to the bottom of the ocean where it won't decompose back into carbon dioxide because that is an issue with using plant life. The issue with that is, is kind of the issue that I hinted at with things like putting sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere or using dust essentially in orbits to reflect sunlight you don't have a lot of finite control over that mm -hmm. so if you create blooms of algae that has a lot of other negative knock-on effects algae blooms are something we typically try to avoid for example that's a, a byproduct of like farm runoff so yes that could potentially work but it is also risky in itself yeah